Hey Matt, this is Norman from Schaefer Chevrolet here with our 2005 Chevrolet Silverado 2500 HD. Um, I have some really fantastic news for you. This is a pretty nice truck. Um, I did notice when we were driving down the road that there was um, a little bit of shake in the steering wheel and it did pull to the right a little bit. Uh, but let's take a look. Tread, I really don't know how to judge that tread. It looks nice. This tells me it's probably pretty decent um, but some of the really neat things I don't know if I'll be able to show this very well but I'd do my best see if we can get it to focus on the rockers This truck is pretty darn clean, I would say. Those rockers, they're, they're just dirty. They're, they're nice. Well, you can take a look inside the door here. Even the door's really nice in here. So I don't know if somebody did a lot of really nice work or never had to in the first place uh, but we got power seat power windows mirrors locks we do have the extending mirrors now here's the well I did notice this was a little loose when uh, when I was getting in any any problems I've been finding with this are so minor that they can be very well overlooked um, but here's the other really great news nothing on the dash no lights no nothing um, and I checked this it doesn't smell like a smoker to me but I checked the ashtray just in case, um, and I just see like a little gum wrapper or something in there. I don't see any ash in there. I don't see any rips, tears, burn holes. It doesn't smell like a smoker. The AC blows cold. You got the dual climate controls. Um, the the heat blows hot, so both airs work exactly how they're supposed to. Up top here, directional temperature in the mirror. A little bit of space up here. I guess we get a free can of Grizzly. We just took this in. Um, so we're still we still got to clean it and uh, so it's surprisingly clean for not having been through the process yet Back here as you can see seats look brand new they look like they've never been sat in But like I said still working on cleaning up I see a Gatorade bottle over there um, I did notice this too that's the only issue I see with this console up here. Not a huge deal. Got a pretty nice gas tank cover there, but as you can see, it is just a cover. Now usually, right in here, it's a good spot to look, but I don't see anything there. I did notice back here, though, when I was walking around it, that it's got... I don't know, it's got something going on here. I feel like you could pull that off. But I'm not even going to try. Oh, this is... Looks like maybe... Maybe a rust bubble starting there. And these corners look like they're flared out a little bit. I don't know if it's just me or what, but those corners seem a little flared out. have to check on that part um, I did notice on this side it, it almost I don't know if you can tell very well but it seems like there were some you know, pretty decent scratches um, they're minor but I mean I don't know if you can see that black is a hard color to video always has been can't really see very well when it comes to glare things like that it almost acts as a mirror but the really cool thing about this truck is just, for the most part, how clean it seems. Uh, like I showed you on the rockers on the other side, you know, just for good measure, let's check this side also. Yeah, you might not be able to see it, but 
It looks pretty nice under here also. Once again, this is Norman from Schaefer Chevrolet. Took it for a drive, seemed pretty nice, so I do notice a couple dings in there. You almost can't tell until the sun hits it. Yeah, probably won't even be able to tell in the video. Uh, but like I said, Norm from Schaefer's, nice truck, definitely worth taking a look at. Uh, thanks for watching.